Hey everybody, it's Chris Lowe here. In this screencast, I'm going to share with you how to use the app Puppet EDU, also known as Shadow Puppet. There it is. There's the icon there. I'm going to tap on it. And here's the dashboard for Shadow Puppet. This is where your videos in the end will be saved. So Shadow Puppet's an app that allows you to add a bunch of pictures or images to a slideshow and then also add your voice uh, or narration over top of each photo. So it's a bunch of pictures and your voice or the student's voice. Here are some activity ideas from the folks at Shadow Puppet in language arts and math as well as science, social studies, art, and foreign languages. I also compiled a few ideas myself so hopefully there's something in here that's going to work for you. Now let's go back to the app to see how we create a narrated slideshow. To start, we tap on Create New, and I'm going to tap on that. Now, it um, goes to this section of my camera roll, but I'm going to scroll down here and tap on Recents. And the reason I'm doing that is because I took some screenshots of uh, some sturgeon, so I'm going to add those to my slideshow. So here we have, uh, I'm going to tap on Pick a Few Photos. So I've got my three photos in there. If I want to reorder them, then I uh, do a long press on them. So I tap on it and do a long press and it um, allows me to drag and drop it so I can reorder my photos that way. Once I like that, I tap on next in the bottom right. Here's my screen where I'm gonna do my recording. You can see the record button down at the bottom. If I wanted to add a title, I could do that. And I wanna make them a little bit smaller. There we go. And change the color to, we'll go with red. All right, so now I've got that little uh, text will come up on here. Um, also on the left-hand panel, you can see it's blank, but when I tap on start, there's gonna be a little magic wand appear there. This will allow me to have a little pointer that I can use while I am talking. So I'm gonna hit record, and it gives me a little bit of a countdown tap on the magic wand and I'm going to tap on the red circle. All right, so here is my uh, body of the sturgeon and you can see the almost like an armored plate or these things called scutes that are on the sturgeon. Tap the recording button at the bottom to pause it. If I wanted to take a little bit of a break, I can advance to my next slide by tapping on the arrow on the right and then go back to my paused button and that will allow me to um, fire up my recording again. Here's the, uh, the sturgeon life cycle and the sturgeon life cycle is quite long and you can see it starts out with um, as eggs they get fertilized they go into a juvenile stage where they are very small little things and they gradually grow up into these very massive large sturgeon fish. Um, I'm not going to pause. I'm going to tap on my arrow on the right hand side and it automatically goes to the next slide. Here's a photo of a sturgeon habitat and sturgeon quite like habitat that looks like this with lots of logs and rocks as opposed to a smooth uh, bottom surface. Tap on my recording to pause it. So you can see that there's a, a few little features here but it's quite uh, straightforward of how to create this. Once I'm, I'm finished my slideshow, if I wanted to, the undo button, you could see the UO, that's actually undo. If I wanted to undo uh, recording for a particular slide, I could uh, tap on that. But I'm gonna click on the check mark over on, this, on the right hand side, which is save. And if I tap on that, my recording does get saved. And we're not going to add anything to the, um, any, of the, any social media. We're just going to tap on done. I could tap on preview, but I'm, for speed sake, I'm going to tap on done. And you can see it's saved there. Now, I've also, here's the, the key part, is that I'm also now going to go into my Photos app. And you can see in my Photos app, there it is. There is my video. And if I tap on it, sturgeon and you can see the almost like an armored plate or these things called scutes that are on the sturgeon. Here's the uh, the sturgeon life cycle and the sturgeon life cycle 
is quite long, and you can see it starts as that for now. So the app shadow puppet, a great quick way to put together some photos with your um, oral explanation or description of those photos on top of it, and it makes a movie. All right, so there you go. Have a good day.